of 742 National Capital Squadron Brass and Reeds Band as they perform our national anthem. Naming campaigns seem to be all the rage in the capital as first the Red Blacks called upon fans to help them name the team. Now they're asking fans for help in naming their new mascot. It's exciting. Everything, the thing that I like about this is everything is new. And that's just another thing of adding on to what, to what we're trying to build. And so it's exciting. The as yet unnamed lumberjack themed mascot was unveiled in front of a crowd of 10,000 at Canadian Tire Center for a family day afternoon game with the Ottawa 67s hosting the Owen Sound attack. Several members of the coaching staff and the players from the Red Blacks were on hand for the ceremonial puck drop for the opening face-off. Hey, you know, we're here, we mean business. Here are some of the players that are going to be part of this ride and to really get the fans excited uh, with the season that's drawing closer and closer and closer day in and day out. And uh, I know we just can't wait for everything to, to kind of, you know, come together as far as get all the you know, all of our players intact. Uh, i got to find a house and, uh, you know, get settled and uh, we'll definitely be ready to go. Red Blacks head coach Rick Campbell said that the mascot was a highly guarded secret, even from him. Looked good to me. I, first time we saw it, they, that was a complete secret for everyone. Because I, I even asked 10 minutes ago before we went out there for that, they said, no, you'll find out when everybody else does. And you could count quarterback Henry Burris among the mascot's new fans. Burris said that the mascot, the Lumberjack theme, paid tribute to a few colorful chapters from Ottawa's past. Uh, to me, uh, it, it to me exemplifies just the, the true written character of of the people of Ottawa, you know what I mean? From day one, I mean, this city was built on the premise of hard work and the outdoorsman mentality. And, uh, and still today, even though, of course, it, it being the, the nation's capital and a government's uh, town, uh, it's still about the hard work as far as the foundation of what made this city uh, become what it is today. And uh, I mean, to me, it, to me, it fits the bill and to have the true meaning of, of the Rough Riders still involved as far as, uh, you know, as far as in the team's identity. Uh, just shows you that they didn't forget about where they came from, but uh, where this organization is going now, being the Red Blacks and with the ownership group being local and the great things that those guys have brought to the table, uh, it shows you that this organization is definitely heading in the right direction. And uh, I just can't wait to get the rest of the guys going, find a home here in the city, and uh, let's get camp going soon. At Canadian Tire Center for the Ottawa Sun, I'm Aiden Helmer.